hi there I am MJ today I will show you how to install Windows 10 by using pen drive so I will show you the easy stuff first we need to make the Windows 10 bootable pen drive so that's why we are going to Google so go to Google open the Google page and type here Windows 10 download and search for this okay so you will get this first link Windows 10 download Microsoft this official website of Microsoft click on this and come down and here there is a two option like uh, 32 bit and 62 bits so I have 32 bits operating system so I am going to take the 32 bit if you have 64 bit you you should take the 64 bit so after this just click on your th 32 bits like this this is a tool okay just save this tool so here you can see the download is start so you can see download is near to complete yeah it's completed now so just click on this okay it is asking the permission to install so click on yes and now close this okay so you will get this dialog box uh, and showing that what do you want to do so we are going to create a installation bootable USB pen drive so I'll show you just click or uh, select the create any solution media for other PC and then click on next okay so now you have to select the languages okay select the language okay and I'm going to install the Windows 10 Pro so I'm going to take the Windows 10 Pro and the architecture is 32 bit so I have selected the 32 bit so you keep it 32 bits now you can change it to 64 bits and click next and now select the USB flash drive as you can see here and it's saying it needs to be at least 3 GB but I suggest you to use the 4 GB pen drive with clean formatted so don't use the any file in the pen drive so use the clean formatted pen drive and click next as you can see here my pen drive is showing now so be careful uh, you you have to know where is the bootable is going on so select the correct pen drive okay so this is my removable, de removable device pen drive click on next okay now click on next after you click next you uh, it will take some time to make the bootable uh, USB drive as you can see here it's processing creating the Windows 10 media like bootable drive okay and it's finished now as you can see here your USB flash drive is ready so now finish click on finish and remove your USB drive and reconnect uh, your USB drive and restart your PC okay so connect your USB drive to your PC now and restart your PC and go to your boot setting like CMOS setting, BIOS setting, advanced BIOS setting features okay and take the first boot as a pen drive so here you can see click on first boot and this is the my first boot device uh, the pen drive USB flash so you, re you re read the your instruction as per your given motherboard instruction so BIOS setting okay so I am moving upside my pen drive, generic pen drive, okay. Yeah, upside. So my first first boot device is pen drive. So now save it, you are setting and click yes, okay. Okay, now it's ready to install your Windows, select your languages and time and currency format and keyboard. So let it to default as you can see here. Yeah okay us us and click on install now okay so setup is start now and it's asking the product key so i have product key but i will enter later so right now i'm going to skip this click on skip okay and click on i accept the license terms check on this and click on next and 
and now click the custom and install windows only advanced click on this okay and this is the important thing you, you you must have to know which drive you are going to install uh, the windows 10 so partition 2 is my c drive so i am going to install windows 10 in the c drive so we, we must to format this so i am going to format the c drive that is partition 2 okay it's formatting select and click on format and as you can see here the total size and free size is same 29.2 gb and 21.2 gb okay so i am installing windows 10 in this partition so click next now okay this is the installation process going on i'm going to fast forward some video here because i don't want to you feel bored okay it will take some time to install all this thing okay it's almost done okay installation feature updates and the finalizing so all this thi thing is it will install so it will in reboot your system so don't press any key let it to do uh, the window installation so it's now you can see that it's ready getting ready and it's again again product key and i will do it later yeah so click on do this later and click on use express setting as you can see here click on use express setting okay so your system will restart several time you don't need to press any key just do it to uh, what windows installation going on okay okay look at that it's and now uh, it's asking to who is on this pc uh, click on i own this and click next okay i don't have any account i don't want to create right now any account i will create later so skip the step click on skip the step here you can see okay give the your pc name like whatever your home office or business so enter your pc name here username okay and if you want you can give the password but i don't want to give the password so click next okay this is the final moment is going on to start the windows 10 very soon i will get the desktop of windows 10 okay it's setting some things for me it's showing for you and me okay so as i said it will restart several times you don't need to press any key don't press any keys so it's now setting the apps okay yeah that's it I got the Windows 10 desktop now. The Windows 10 is successfully installed into my desktop PC. So this is a procedure to install Windows 10 your PC. So after this, you can uh, enter your product key later, and you can activate your Windows 10. So that's all for today. Thanks for watching, and if you have any question, you can ask me in comments. So see you in next video. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to like, comments, and subscribe. Thank you very much.